sahlan and welcome to the 20th edition of CoinMina's weekly newsletter, Kalam Crypto. Every week, we will bring you the latest news and developments from the exciting world of cryptocurrencies. This week, the Ethereum 2.0 upgrade is delayed, the Bitcoin Lightning Network aims to disrupt global payments, and stablecoins are on the rise. All that and more, so let's dive into this week's letter and talk crypto. Global news. Ethereum's merge delayed. The much-anticipated upgrade of the Ethereum blockchain has been delayed from June till the end of the year. The merge is a fork event that will change Ethereum's consensus mechanism from proof-of-work to proof-of-stake. This move is expected to reduce Ethereum's energy consumption by 99%. This is not the first announcement of a delay, as the original target completion date was in 2019. On a positive note, this week Ethereum developers successfully tested the proof-of-stake on mainnet, in what's called a shadow fork. A shadow fork is an experimental exercise occurring on the mainnet instead of a testnet. The tests were successful with only some minor issues identified. A second shadow fork test will occur on the 22nd of April, and the outcome would be key in deciding the timing of the merge. Keep an eye on Stablecoins Stablecoins market capitalization is growing rapidly and has reached almost $200 billion, up from $40 billion last year. March alone saw a 26% increase in on-chain volume of stablecoins compared to February. Record high inflation in the United States. The Consumer Price Index, CPI, soared to 8.5% this month, the highest inflation rate in over 40 years. This means the US dollar is 8.5% less valuable today than what it was this time last year. Luna acquires more Bitcoin. Again. The Luna Foundation Guard acquired an additional $100 million in Bitcoin and now holds over 42,000 Bitcoin, worth approximately $1.72 billion, which makes them the 19th largest hodler of Bitcoin. Deep Dive Lightning Network aims to disrupt global payments During the 2022 Bitcoin conference, the CEO of Strike, Jack Mallers, announced that they have partnered with Shopify, Blackhawk, and NCR to power transaction across the Bitcoin payments rails using the Bitcoin Lightning Network. It's important to understand that this innovation does not require the customer or the merchant to hold or own any Bitcoin. Instead, dollar payments are being processed over the Bitcoin network. For example, a customer walks into a store to buy shawarma for $2. Previously, their options were to pay in cash or via card. But now, you can pay via the Bitcoin Lightning Network. The customer scans the QR code to pay. The customer's dollars are converted into Bitcoin, transferred at the speed of light to the merchant, then convert it back to dollars, and reach the merchant's account as dollars. Both the customer and the merchant don't hold Bitcoin for any amount of time. The dollar payment simply uses the Bitcoin network to transfer the value at the speed of light from customer to merchant. Instant cash finality with almost zero fees. This is the first significant innovation in retail payments since the introduction of credit cards over 50 years ago. Currently, merchants pay Visa or MasterCard anywhere from 1.5 to 3% per transaction. The strike announcement means that approximately 85% of all retail merchants in the United States, including McDonald's, Walmart, and Starbucks, will be able to accept US dollars, euros, or Bitcoin, or any other currency without having to pay credit card fees to Visa or MasterCard. This announcement highlights the important fact that Bitcoin is not just an asset that people hold as a store of value. It is also a payments network. It allows anyone in the world to send value to anyone else instantly and for almost zero fees. If you are a merchant, what would you prefer? Accepting payments instantly while paying almost zero fees or the old legacy system of paying up to 3% fees and waiting for days for the intermediary banks to transfer cash into your account? I think the answer is clear. CoinMina News Zero means zero. For a limited time, enjoy real zero trading fees on CoinMina. Zero trading fees, zero hidden trading fees, and transparent and accurate prices. Buy crypto at the real market price, you know, the one without an increased spread. The offer is valid until Friday, April 22nd, 2022. Start trading today and take advantage of this special offer. CoinMina giveaway carnival continues. We have airdropped $3,400 in Bitcoin or 0.084 BTC to 34 lucky winners so far through our crypto quiz. Don't worry if you missed the chance. This Ramadan, we are giving away $200 in Bitcoin every day of the month with the CoinMina Ramadan Giveaway Carnival. Check out our Instagram and Twitter accounts to see how to participate and win. Tweet of the week comes from Elon Musk, and it simply says, I made an offer. And the offer is not to buy Twitter stocks, it's to buy all of Twitter, every stock. Wow. 
Quiz Corner. Last week's question. What percentage of the current Bitcoin supply has not moved in over a year? The answer, around 60%. This week's question. What is the second largest stable coin in terms of market capitalization? UST, Terra, USDT, Tether, USDC, or DAI? We'll tell you the answer in next week's episode. That's all we have for now. We will be back next week for another episode of Kalam Crypto.